and Ivan Mustalier. His nickname was a ghost because he's here one day and then gone the next day. He was a stone cold killer. He's an urban legend, rumored to be connected to Castro. He was doing hits for hire in Cuba. But also rumored to have done work for the Medellin cartel. You had what are called cocaine cowboys. The great boom of the 1980s, when cocaine is flooded into South Florida, and who's arrived? Annabelle Mustillier. He was a great mastermind of bank heists and burglaries. They walked right into the front of the bank. No guns, no shotguns, no threats. It was absolutely amazing. 8,000 pieces of jewelry. Five million dollars minimum. And seven million dollars in currency. Then he developed a scheme for robbing jewelry stores. Two employees hear a loud, booming noise. Mustelier comes through the drywall, heavily armed. Moustillier and his crew would violently attack the employees. This was brazen. So law enforcement, they go after any addresses that Moustillier had. You had FBI, the US Marshal Service, ATF, Interpol, looking for him. And all of a sudden, he just fell off the face of the earth. He disappeared. He was gone.